Hey leaders, I hope you guys are good and you guys have been consistently asking me one question and some of you have realized that every time when you come to Sketch Fab and you come to the download button, in some cases you don't even find the the format uh, for .fbx, you only find the .glb. Né? And I want to show you what happens when you download the .glb and so that we see how we can actually make it simple. So I'll choose this one because it has a smaller size of 5 megabyte. So your size is important, guys. If we are choosing 20 megabyte, it means we're going to make the app much bigger. bigger. So we don't want our app to be super huge because you must be cognizant that majority of people who use our applications might be in the situation where they have less data to actually be able to uh to to run the simulations in their game by the way uh, data must fall you know so so that we can get people good stuff but anyway back to my issue they might have um not enough data to be able to run these things so we can't if we have an option to move away from 20 megabyte to 5 megabyte let's take the the action of the 5 megabyte so that it becomes less 5 megabyte is probably equals to the song that you, you stream you know so let's rather choose that and download that so i'm gonna drag it into the project i know i didn't choose a car now i just choose a more move I'm going to drag it into, into the project that doesn't have the .g, uh, that doesn't have the plugin that opens uh, .glp. I'm going to just drag it here under assets, right? Immediately when we drag it under assets, you will see now that moment we can't even open it. We can't even drag it. It gives you this this icon that shows that it cannot be open inside the unit right so that's what happens when you you use a .glb but there is a way to solve this thing and that way it's basically through uh using what we call the unity glt fast package so this package is the one that allows you to be able to allow you to move that content that you wanted to view it supports the .glb file so you may ask yourself what's the difference to the fba .glb and all these things think about them like music format you know we got mp3 we got uh dot wave and all this kind of stuff so you choose wave it's usually bigger size it's more quality compared to dot uh, dot mp3 you understand so it's the same thing with 3d format we got fbx that comes with animations um and textures and all that we got dot obj that only comes with textures and stuff like that and and it doesn't come with animation and then we got dot glb which is more optimized to work on the website or to make your app feel more optimized to so we would use the GLP because it also comes with animation. It also comes with textures and stuff like that, you know. So for us to install Unity GLT first, you must come here and copy this link. Copy this link. And then after copying this link, you guys are now going to be introduced uh, to something new that you didn't know. This thing, it's called uh, a package manager. So a package manager it's basically where you can get the tools that can assist to make your project much quicker so remember we have copied this link here we have to copy this link so that we can install uh, this package so once we copy it it open the project your project that doesn't have dot glt file and come here in the plus sign and i think it's installed by name uh click install by name and copy that thing there uh the link that you got and start to install then automatically from that point unity will start installing your uh unity glt first so what is once it's done importing and installing and doing all sort of stuff we can then open our file and see if our file 
it's able to open now because it will give us superpowers that we can do fbx you can do to glp you don't have to stress anymore if you don't see dot fbx but you only see dot glp so let's wait for it guys uh, this is the moment that you could quickly go and get tea and come back once it's done but i'm glad uh, it's done very quick as I was trying to go and get T. So we are back. We got our Unity GLT fast here, right? It's done. Immediately after it's been installed, check what happens to that icon. The icon changes, becomes the blue box now. See what also can happen. I can bring our moment inside Unity. We can have it there. Maybe let's move it this way. And we put it that way. Alan. Just for picture purposes. Right? This is me just playing around, trying to get something nice. But the idea was me to show you how to actually import your dot glb file right so there we go <laughs> i hope it makes sense but there we have it there we have it so guys get prepared because you're gonna be using a lot of dot glbs in the next coming task that are coming to you